Come on then, let's go. Welcome back, Sergeant Callahan. They're waiting for you in the Imaginarium. And sir, please be careful this time. Please, you've got to believe me. I hacked into the system to override the peace mechanism, but just for a second, I never meant to start a war. I'm sorry, all data removed. Survival mode activated. Shit's hitting the fan here in the south quarter, sir. I'm initiating the shields west side. Watch out, Commander. These dumb bots are tearing each other to pieces already. Get out of there. God damn it. They're hacked. Abort! Abort! All right, Jack, we have a bee planet in range if you really have to set her down. Try not to total it this time, Captain. Starfleet's not here to subsidize your shitty flying skills, you know. Ah, oh, fuck you, Rooney. Your navigational expertise got us into this mess in the first place. The least you can do is steer us somewhere with a chance of survival. Steering you, I can do. The survival's on you, buddy. So it's true, then. The Lorian was right after all. You are a lord of darkness. You're a fool. Weak and nothing. You dare to question the lineage of Dreadfell. Twelve millennia we've ruled the Electrosians without losing a single soldier. And here you are with cowardice dripping from your lips. Since the dawn of conscious man, his innate fear of the unique has sealed his fate of inferiority. Destined to exist within a fraction of what true human experience can be. Until now. My discovery of a simple strain of inhibitor means humans are no longer bound to futile freeze or flight responses. Only the dominant choice remains. Fight! And, and I and fought I my way, way here, here through seas of vile and storms, storms of war, war to find you, you and ask for the for wisdom of Odysseum. Fine, fine. Bring me the lamp star and I might let you come with me to the nether level. Now go, get me the lamp and be back here by sunrise. Or you're on your own. Ah, don't you just love the sight of Mars in the morning? Wish you were here, man. Catching the moons and kicking the dust. Uh, I'm a little busy right now, Rogers, but thanks for the invite. When the dust settles, it's always the same. Fragments of life scattered amongst the rubble. But there's no time to stop. All this in the blink of an eye. Then onwards, through the smoke, through the heat, and dive into a foxhole. And wait for the next command. I told you already. Get the book. Get rid of Dr. Black. And bring me the blueprints before Donald gets his filthy hands on them. Got it? And don't even think about blabbing to that police friend of yours. Or you might get another visit from that little psychopathic friend of mine. Now fuck off. Come on then, you lizard brain bastard. Come and get me. Yeah. <laughs> 